Hello everyone! Today, I'll guide you through EPOS Now's intuitive, user-friendly stock management page, showing you how to effortlessly manage your inventory. The page is designed to be visually straightforward, displaying all stock levels at a glance. It's simple to interact with when adjusting figures, making management stress-free, just the way it should be. Unlike your main product management page, this list will only include products you've set up for stock tracking. There are plenty of columns you can browse through here including cost price, sale price, and category. But to edit these, you'll need to return to your product list. Here, we're only concerned with stock levels and the minimum, maximum stock level columns. We've created an EPOS Now crew neck with a stock value of 30. To begin editing this, you'll need to select Adjust Stock. So, for our example, say we've got five new crew necks in. We select the stock column for crew necks and either toggle up five times or type in the new stock figure. You'll notice a delta appear, detailing a positive or negative change in the stock level. Say we complete a stock take and instead of 30 t-shirts, we only have 28. You'll see minus two in the delta. You'll also notice a hazard indicator appear as we're now below our minimum stock level. This is really useful as it draws your attention to any products you're running low on. If you're not worried about your t-shirt stock, you can reduce or even remove your minimum value from this page. When we set the minimum stock value as a value lower than the current stock, you'll notice that the warning disappears. If you've finished your stock changes and are happy with everything you've done, it's time to hit review, which tells the system who made the changes. Remember, if your name doesn't appear, it's likely you don't have user permissions to adjust stock. Although optional, you can provide a reason for the changes such as new stock, store transfer, or wastage. Then, you'll see you can set a cost price for all new stock. If the cost price differs from your usual price, you can adjust that here to keep your profit calculations accurate. The product list will always display the most relevant cost price depending on the product's stock batch. Make sure to review each of the changes you've made and make any final amendments before you select Confirm to save the changes. And remember, like most EPOS Now reports, you can export this page via CSV, Excel file, or you can print a physical copy. And there you have it. You're now ready to master your stock management. Thanks for your time and have a lovely day.